It is the Mercedes-Benz Unimog U1300L Winter Dienst kit from Revell, Germany. Now, the reason why I'm taking a look at this kit is because it hasn't been on the market for about 17 years, 18 years now. The last time we saw it, the last time this kit was reissued in this form was in 2001. This part of this kit was last seen in 2013 as the fire truck version. So it is today's what's in the box look. Welcome in today to the what's in the box look. So a brief history about this kit, it was first re first issued, first released in 1985 as a fire truck. And over the course of the last 30 some odd years, Revell Germany has reissued this kit in different configurations, ranging from a fire truck to a police truck, to a military truck, to I believe a uh, rally support vehicle. Uh, this version and a couple of those I am probably forgetting about. So it has run the gamut of different types of configurations. So basically, the cab and the chassis stay the same. It's what those, it's all everything behind the cab that has been changed. and looking at the rest of the parts that make up for the cab. Will be this Parts tree, which is going to contain pieces for the salt container and the plow. It's a big, big plow. And last of the orange parts trees, and you can see one of them kind of fell off. So we'll just look at that piece first. I believe this is just going to be the bed where everything attaches to. And the rest of the parts tree. And moving right along to the last parts tree in this bag. And now the big, big parts tree in this kit. There's a lot of stuff on it, so let's get started with it. And first, there is the frame. Up top side. There you got your engine halves, your engine block halves. There's the wheels, the wheel backs, dashboard, one last main parts tree. Now the clear parts. First is the uh, amber beacons parts tree. There's about let's see one. Uh, and the 
clear clear parts through for your windshield and other clear bits some other little goodies that are in the kit first off some um, what you will use for cabling or uh, hydro or I guess you'd say hydraulic lines although on the box art they are black in the kit they gave you gray and some in a length of chain and now we turn our attention to the tires as you can see you get five sets of tires one will be for the spare they are hollow tires but they are also very very hard almost like a hard plastic than a rubber and as you can see there it says Dunlop so no blank sidewall tires in this kit and last but not least we come to the decal sheet and get started it's broken down into sections and basically um, it's a section of what you, deciding on what version you're going to make it's broken down into sections so you use these these decals with this you know it's broken down so obviously the, the stuff up here is going to be used for each version So real quick, we're going to take a look at the decal placement guides for the various versions you can make for this kit. So here, we're going to, here will be the first two. I do, under, I do understand it's hard to see which decals. Basically, everything's going to be orange, except for one. And then you can see the one on the right will be purple. That'll be the Unterweger, Unterweger, Unter, something, I don't know how to pronounce it. And then there we go, the last one on the back. So there you have it, folks. That is the Mercedes Benz Unibog U, U1300L Winter Dyson from Velodrome. So on that note, thank you so much for watching. We will see you next time.